American scientists have developed the whitest color ever. It reflects 98% of the sun's radiation. They say that if you paint houses with this new color, for example, then you won't need to cool them down during the summer because they absorb no heat. Some say that white isn't even a color as opposed to black that absorbs everything for itself. What does Kabbalah say? Is white a color or isn't it? No, white takes nothing for itself. So it's not a color? A color is something that already takes something. If we're talking about the concept of white, then it means that I receive nothing from the outside. What is white? It's felt as though it does not exist. What do you mean? Where did it go? It demands nothing from no one. So much so that as if it's transparent. Because it demands nothing for itself. Neither attention nor nothing. You owe it nothing. There aren't many such people today. It depends on education. Okay, going back to this initiative, they say that if we take this white color and we paint 1% of our planet with it, we'll stop global warming. And I was thinking, maybe if we take this white and we paint our internality, our attitude toward each other with it, maybe that could stop something. That would stop all problems, not only warming, but all problems. All the viruses, wars, you name it, if this how we'll behave. What's this magic? What's the technology behind it? Your attitude? Towards whom? Towards what? Toward nature? That you want nothing from the still, the vegetative, and the animate, and other people. You just want one thing, for everyone to feel good. This means to act like white. And what does a person live from? That he receives from everyone, but to the measure to which he needs in order to exist and no more and everything else he uses to the benefit of others. And how do I develop, evolve, what do I acquire? You develop only in order to serve others. Why? What else do you need? For them to serve me, for example. Then they serve you too? By receiving only what's necessary, and in everything else, think about you. Would you like to live in this kind of white world? Of course, what could be better than this kind of life? Talking about colors, what was then black created for? In order to show us how egoistic we are and how much we're ruining our life by it. Is it a must to see it? Yeah. Why? Otherwise, you won't want to turn it into white because to turn it into white means to rise above our own nature.